Greetings. In this lesson, we examine the principle of operation of the unit branch, which compares the value. In this lesson, I want to show you how to create a simple condition. We will improve the script from the second lesson and add a code that will display a message in the console if the number of jumps will be more than 20. Accordingly, for this we shall discover assets. Go to script section. Open script storage manager. Edit. Our script opened. I want to make if the number of jumps will be more than 20, then I will write in the console that the number of jumps is over 20. Otherwise I'll write that number jumping under 20. First of all, I'll take a unit that will compare two numbers. That is the number from the repository C number 20, and the result will fall into the block branch. For this let's take a block that will compare two numbers. Right-click the menu. Number section. And choose the next block. Next action I take the unit branch, which and actually will compare the result. For this write range and bind block message output to the console. Which simply displays the current hop count. Link it with the unit branch. After displaying the number of our jumps there was a comparison. Next Y block number output value is a boolean value. That is, true or false. And I think you can see that it's connected to the branch block. Let's do that. I mean the result of this comparison will fall into the branch block, which depends on the state result true or false will be executed specified actions. In the field A I will specify the current value of the money variable in the vault. I'll put the number 20 in the block. So we compare the A value with the value B. If A is greater than B, in the result is true. Otherwise we get the value false. The following by action I have made it my the corresponding message was displayed in console. To do this, take the log block. Duplicate it control C, control V and let's tie it up. If the value is equal true, and if the value is false, too let's make a connection. Let's just keep it simple write more than 20. And here write less than 20. Actually, if you need to bind several conditions by design. For example, it must be number and that number must be more than 20. Roughly speaking, you can link two blocks branch as follows. If value equals true. That is, we will compare first input and second input value. I think the algorithm you understand. Let's check the script we just did. Close the script editor. Our script is already tied to platform. That is to some object on the stage. Let's just run it. Click F12 to see the console. Let's make the jump. 22. Respectively value greater than 20, so we get value greater than 20 I suggest as a test set here the number 30 dot to you could see what the result would be if the input was false. Let's jump. And as you see the value below 20 dot and how only we reach 30 jumps dot value greater than 20. Think the principle the work of the unit branch you understood. I hope this lesson was useful for you dot if you have some questions remained. Ask them at commentary. Good luck.